Hey guys, just letting you know that I'm currently giving away 99 overall final edition Lair Fitzgerald on the Xbox One. So if you're interested in joining the giveaway, there's going to be a link in the description below to the tweet that's going to show you guys how you enter the giveaway. So good luck to everybody. Right after that struggle of a game, now we're up against another opponent. And this is going to be my last game with the draft win or lose. Hopefully we can cap it off with a W, man. We got to get our 79 overall draft champions legend, a draft champs ring, man. We're juking to the inside all the way down to almost a 30 yard line in that kick return. Some power option, just keeping it with Cam Newton. He's got the edge falling forward for a gain of five or six. I want to try my best to do some plays I've never ran before. We got Cam Newton and he's got power and he's not going to be able to pick the first down right there though. Actually, yes, he is. Got to give my undrafted star running back a nice run here. Attempt. Oh, my God. Who the fuck was that? That man just lunged like 80 yards on me right quick, bruh. Uh-oh. Ah! Oh, God! <laughs> What's wrong with me? All right, so, my opponent actually has some pretty good users this game, which is definitely something I'm not used to seeing in draft champs. Uh, we're going to motion... Our RB receiver down, and we're not going to be able to get the ball off in time. That's fourth down. All right, fourth and 13. Running a playbook we've never ran before on offense. I think we got a chance in this one. Uh-oh, we got Ted Ginn. Is it a throw? Oh, my God. It's on the money, too, with Cam Newton. Let's go, man. Fourth and 13. We're going to convert. Y'all best be learning. Cover four is a not going to work. All right, so I'm starting off with putting some points on the board after what looked like it was going to be a rocky first possession. Actually turned out to be pretty good. He's taken it out of the end zone seven yards deep. But let's go ahead and wrap him up. Did he get to the 20? Yes, he did to the 21. Is that, is that Eli Manning as his quarterback? Terrell Davis, Isaac Bruce. He's probably going to be trying to pound the rock as much as possible. We got all sorts of people over there. He broke off two tackles and ended up juking up out of bounds. If my opponent was smart, he'd be pounding the ball the whole game, man. Good running backs and draft champs are definitely, definitely, Definitely a huge advantage, and I thought that I was going to have the interception right there, but unfortunately, I am not going to be able to come down with it. Third and eight here. we got to watch out for the screen. He might be trying to force feed his running back. He's throwing it to the seams, and Pryor has got... He really has the ability to lay the wood there, but he's just not going to. So Chase Daniels is the guy behind the offense, man. He's going to be the one swinging the rocket. That's mine, baby. Let's go. Kyle Fuller. Thank you, Gamagan. Look, I'm sorry, but y'all should know by now not to try, my man. We got Ted Ginn on the slant, open across the middle of the field, moving the sticks already. Gonna try pounding the ball here, man. I gotta get my undrafted running back started here. Juke to the inside. Oh my god, we got open field ahead of us. Great juke to the 10. And we're gonna walk into the end zone. Untouched, man. Let's go. That undrafted is a beast. What's that guy's name? Christian Michael. Jesus. Jesus. I'm telling you, if you can get a base running back with 90 speed, there is no reason to draft a running back unless they have more than 90 speed, man. That guy's a beast. So I guess my undrafted players came to play today. Isaac Bruce shrugged off a tackle and ended up losing yards because of it. So I'm thinking maybe I should play some ranked draft champions. You guys, one of you guys, well, a couple of you guys had actually suggested that I play some ranked draft champs, and I kind of just ignored it. My man's probably trying some verticals here. No, he's not. He's going for a Z-spot. Actually, a screen, man, but we got our 79 overall legend. He's going to end up getting wrapped up, man. He's get, He got actually blocked by 79 overall legend. Good screen. What throws me off is that screen out of that formation always looks like they're running Z-spot on the right side. He's finally trying to run the ball again. I got a horrible stick, but Woodson's over there to not be able to wrap him up. He's trucking forward. Come on, man. That's unfortunate as shit. That's my B. I definitely expect him to just abandon the run game, but from now on, we're going to do a better job at bottling that up ourselves. Checking for screens before I do anything. He's throwing it up over the top, and I was just bite. I bit down a little bit too much to not be able to grab that pick. I don't know who Williams is, but that man's got a beard and a half. We definitely got to man him up so we don't get bearded on again. He's got Terrell Davis out of the backfield. Good game. Prior. I can't remember what his first name is, but I know he can lay the wood. He's coming out in a screen, and I'm going to get the ball off. Horrible play. We got the man, the myth, the legend, man. We got Mingo looking across the middle of the field. We're moving up on the ball, and we're not going to get an animation, dude. Are you serious? Dude, they did my man Mingo wrong right there. I was sitting right there for that pick, and I didn't even fucking jump, dude. EA. Give me a break. All right, let's be honest. That was way, way, way not fair. They literally threw that right to Mingo, and I didn't even jump up and get an animation. And that guy's fast as fuck, too. Man, this game's dumb. God damn it. I've been trying to tell you guys that this shit is rigged. We're going to try running the ball again with our undrafted running back. Looks like we got the edge this time. No, we don't. Jesus Christ. No huddle. I don't care. Bro, this guy's team is mad quick. This time, we're going to cut up the middle of the field. Try and spin, but he has zero spin move. Fucking Christ. All right, we're going to have to dot my man up. Looks like we got Ted Ginn on the sidelines. Yes, we do. And a good throw, believe it or not. 
All right, we're going to be looking for Randall across the middle of the field. Deep, he's only sending like one person, and I fucking... How can I not take off with... Oh. All right, sometimes this game is absolutely ridiculous, but looks like we got Ted Ginn on the sidelines, and he's not going to come down with it. Though. That's third down. My opponent is trying another cover four. That's probably something he shouldn't have done, considering we got him beat, man. No, we don't. Are you fucking serious? All right, we're really looking for the same play again, but he might be coming out in man coverage this time. No, he's not. And we still got our B receiver open, and we're going to be able to hit him. Slice up that cover four. This guy's fucking clueless. I swear to God. All right, fine. It may have been a cover three, but still, why the hell are you running coverage defense like that? Like, what the fuck are you doing on a, on a play like that? Send heat or come out in man. Do something. Anytime it's like a long first down attempt on fourth, like, you gotta have every man accounted for. It makes no sense to come out and just some sag D like that. Oh my God, he's fucking popped. Picked up scoop and score. Scoop and score. Oh my God, he got fucking Ah, dude, bro, I just laid the fucking lumber with my user right there, right there, man. LaMichael, Jared, what is his name? Kristen, Kristen Michaels, Christina Michaels, Christina Michaels, we're running the ball. We got good vision and getting all the way down to the two yard line. We're going to be looking to toss to the short side. Uh, actually, I'm going to, I'm going to switch it over to the, to the hard side, the stacked side. I think I got a better chance over there and I do with 90 speed. We're going to be able to put the edge and put up another set of points. That's 28, baby. Pac-Man Jones is going to get another attempt here, man. Maybe we can lay the wood again. Lay the wood again? Okay. Lay the wood again? Lay the wood again? Hey guys, this is GD with Smooth Talk Radio. And you'll listen in to this man getting that ass whoop no. Uh oh, play action. He's trying something deep. I'm afraid he's going to take off with his quarterback, so I'm going to crash down. He's throwing across the middle of the field. Carlos Darby. He has no hands. I already knew that going into this. I said Carlos, but I think it's actually... uh. Uh, Robert Darby or something like that. Yeah, but he has absolutely like no fucking hands at all. He's chucking up deep against Rod Woodson and he's gonna come down with it. What the fuck? That was nuts. All right, now my man is looking to get bailed. He's running the ball here. Definitely didn't see that coming, but it doesn't even fucking matter. We're gonna wrap him up. We pretty much contained Terrell Davis very well this game. Not too sure what he's gonna be trying to do here. Looking out for screens. Anything short over the middle is gonna be mine. Dump it off to the flats and we're gonna be pushing him out of bounds there. And that's probably bad, actually. All right, we got Kyle Fuller again watching the middle of the field. And that probably should have been mine. He called a timeout after an inc This kid's fucking clueless. My man actually threw an incomplete pass and then called a timeout. What is this, Madden 17 gameplay trailer? Here's my question for you guys. Do you think that he has yet to learn his lesson? It looks like he did. He's dropping back. Get the ball up. Just get the ball off. Okay, that's fine. We'll go in half. That's okay. All right, up on multiple possessions here, and the only time he ever actually really scored was on an aggressive catch. So, yeah, not really afraid of this guy in the slightest. All right, looks like he's going to be trying to pound the ball. Either that or he's just trying to PA max protect and just chucking it up deep. Either way, it's not going to work. He's going to the out route of the quick sideline pass, and he's going to get a gain of about nine. I'm going to have to protect the flats now. All right, so I went ahead and decided to protect the flats this time around. If he's going to try that again, it's not going to go very well. And we are fucking screaming. Who the hell was that? All right, uh, we got Pryor, man. I'm going to be trying to send a little bit of heat with Mingo. My boy Mingo's going to be screaming here. Please let my boy Mingo scream. Let, let him scream on this fool one time. Anything, if he's trying the flats, it's going to be picked. He's throwing it up, and Darius Slay is not going to be able to come up with the interception. For fuck's sakes, man. He's dropping way too many picks. Now, how many picks have I dropped this game? This game, not 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 including the last game, just this game, man. I feel like we've dropped like three or four. And that time he's going to bat it down. That's fine, though, because it was fourth down. All right, going to try and pound the ball here. He's falling for the running back. We got an open lane with Cam Newton. Does he have the speed to get into the end zone? Yes, he does. Diving across. What? They had no right to do my man Superman like that. So we're just going to go ahead and score right here. Let's go. Cam Newton definitely deserved that rushing touchdown the first time. All right, so definitely, I never really run read options for some reason, even though I run the Carolina Panthers offensive playbook in Mutt. I, st I still don't really run read options for some reason. Even though I show you guys in, in literally every single formation that literally the read options are ridiculous, I just don't run them. I literally don't know why. All right, so the opponent may have just given up here. He's running the ball to the opposite side, and, you know, not really getting anything. If I was my man, I would probably just give up. If he's going to try tossing it, we're going to be all over it. We got a QB spy. On the field, looks like he's going to try running it. I really blew it up, to be honest, but I got tripped over my own player because he blew it up, too. All right, we got Kyle Fuller, man. If he's going to try running it, we're going to blow it up, and that we do. Let's go. I know we are not going to let him run that ball 
any more not too sure we're just coming out here with probably another z spot sort of thing looking under the middle he's getting bumped to hell and he's got a nice reception for about eight yards oh man we got mingo now if he tries over the middle of the field he's gonna be picked oh my i was right there they need to stop bailing this man out like that all right so we're covering the deep part of the field ourselves this time he's chucking it to a curl route and darius is gonna lay the wood but he's gonna be able to hold on to it all right this time we got prior is it trey prior uh calvin calvin prior his name is calvin prior that's who i got right here if he's gonna try curls again we're gonna be able to jump and dumping it off to the flats rod woodson's gonna whip the tackle but butler's gonna be able to wrap him up this guy's losing by so much stop dying away down the field you're wasting your time I can't believe this guy doesn't understand that by now i'm just gonna let him get all that shit underneath i feel like this guy doesn't understand that i'm letting him take that shit underneath because it's not gonna help him like if he wants to keep doing this he's gonna drain the clock like you're losing by too much to do that there's no reason to adjust and stop the short ball and and give up the deep ball because it it doesn't matter just let him keep getting about four or five yards it, like there's no point but you know my man is absolutely clueless in these streets to be completely honest he's doing another curl route and once again i I really don't care if you run a curl route. <laughs> so he's going to be trying to toss the ball here. Actually, he's running it, and we're going to be able to blow that up. We literally had three people shooting to the backfield. What are you doing? Yeah, he's taking way too much time to score here, to be completely honest. Not sure what he's trying to do here across the middle, and we're going to stuff him. He's going to try and dive into the end zone, but he's not going to make it in. If he tries a QB sneak here, I'm probably... Oh, no, 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 I... What the fuck just happened? The whole team, my whole defense just shifted for some reason. I didn't even hit anything, and the whole team just fucking shifted out of QB sneak defense. This guy is just repping that hashtag waste his time 26 team because I don't even know why he's still trying. Why doesn't he just run the clock out, man? Wow, Rod Woodson's actually gonna score here too. That's pathetic. I'm not gonna score on purpose though. I'm gonna I'm gonna loop. I'm gonna loop. Now now we wasted the two-minute warning. See that? See, see, because I'm smart. I wasted the two-minute warning. Now I'm going to move back a little bit. Now I'm going to score. Watch this. Watch this. Watch me score here. Get that block, baby. Spin move. Woo! Woo! <laughs> that spin move was ridiculous. <laughs> We're going to keep it with Cam Newton. Just run into his player. Stick skills. Two and clock just trying to get out of this game. I doubt he'll call his timeouts. I feel like he knows his place. Another read option here. And he is actually going to not play the quarterback again, but I'm just going to hand it off to Michaels just in case. I don't want to fumble. Third and four here, you know, uh, I don't know. Doesn't I don't really care if he stops me here. Like, I really don't care. But we're going to... I should have been able to get that anyways, but I have no stick. I suck. We just let the time drain all the way down and kick the field goal, and that's pretty much going to be the game here. All right, so GG's to my opponent. Chill, Will. You know, thanks for actually staying through the whole game. That's always nice to see, man. I always like it when people stick around. And, you know, you know, yeah. So thanks for sticking around, buddy. So if you guys didn't see the beginning of the video for some goddamn reason, I'm giving away a layer for Fitzgerald. In the description, you guys are going to see how to enter the giveaway. It's a tweet. If you don't have a tweeter, I don't know what to say. Make a goddamn tweeter. Um, that's really it, guys. So if you guys liked the video, definitely give it a like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. It's going to be down in the description below as well as the tweet. And let me know what you guys think about the whole Rocket League seeing other games on the channel and all that good old stuff and as always guys goodbye